anticipating this light Tare Sunday, a friend quipped, so are you busting out your Barbie vestments? And I thought to myself, well, what better response to that than to address the spiritual significance of the recent Barbie movie. In Barbie land, everyone is living the best day every day. Everyone has the same nay. Every day they wake up to the same song, same routine, same conversation. It's like having one crayon in a box. What is inconspicuously absent is the complementarity God had in mind when creating man and woman and all of us. But the original sin created a tear in the fabric of that cohesiveness in our human condition which may have prompted this comment from Barbie when in the middle of one of their great parties suddenly asks, have you ever thought about dying? And the music comes to a screeching halt and all that is heard are the collective gasps of those horrified by such a statement. Complementarity occurs when two separate people possess characteristics that when combined make them better than they were on their own. Instinctively, Ken gets this and only has a great day when Barbie looks at him and thus is always trying to gain her attention. Echoing the sadness of Adam in the garden who prior to the creation of Eve feels incomplete. Apparently, there is a real world, our world, and its sadness, pain, mortality is making its way into perfect Barbie land and her mission to go to the real world to investigate and solve the problem, which ultimately is solving the problem of suffering, dying, and death, and really the sin that caused all of that misery and mortality.